Here I have some shamanic drums from Indonesia. All of them are made from goat's hide. And so this one is our medium painted shamanic drum. And this is how it sounds. This one here is our medium tribe shamanic drum. The back is actually a bit different from this one. This one is rope, and this one is actually tied with the hide. And this is how it sounds. It does have a very different sound. And I also think unpainted is probably better, but we do have a painted version. It sounds exactly the same and is made the same way and the same size, so don't need to play that one. And this is our largest shamanic drum. It's rope on the back, and as you can imagine, it's the loudest. And actually, because you have more room to play, you can actually get a lot of different sounds out of this one. So, starting at the edge. Straight away you get a lovely resonance and you could imagine playing this around a fire, which is traditionally how they would do it in shamanism. I can hear the vibrations coming all around the room because of the resonance and I'll just do it like this just so that you can hear it better because the microphone is positioned over there. And that is our shamanic drums.